With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Here we have a question for the chapter thermodynamics. During which of the following thermodynamic process represented by PV diagram, the heat energy absorbed by the system may be equal to area under PV graph. So what is area under PV graph? Area under PV graph is given by the work. So if you find out the area under PV graph, what you will have, it will be equal to the work done. And we know Q is equal to delta U plus W. So we have to find out the process in which the heat absorbed by system may be equal to the area under the PV curve. So if I talk about the first process, it is a process, its equation will be of the form. So A's equation will be of the form P equals to some constant C minus KV. So for the given process, what are we, what is happening? The temperature cannot be constant because for ISO, we know that temperature will be constant for isothermal only. Why am I doing temperature constant? Because Q will be equals to W when delta U will be equals to zero. So I have to make delta U equals to zero. That is the temperature has to remain constant. So if we talk about isothermal process, what will happen? P will be equals to NRT by V where NRT is a constant. So the pressure is going to be inversely proportional to volume. So it, this type of curve looks like, basically I'm talking about a curve such that P equals to one by V or k by v so it will look like a curve y equals to 1 by x and we know how a curve of y equals to 1 by x looks like. So if I talk about our option a it is a straight line so it cannot be our answer that in this case the temperature is not going to remain constant but if I talk about my option b it is clearly of graph of y equals to 1 by x so our option b is going to be correct why because in this case the temperature is going to remain constant. But if I talk about our option C, in this case, we cannot say that the pressure is inversely proportional to volume because it has a concave downwards curve, whereas this was having a convex concave upwards curve. So a minus sign should have been there. And if this becomes minus, then this curve will come. So our option C cannot be an answer. So our only correct option for the given question will be our option B that in option B our work done can be equals to the heat energy absorbed. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.